I have a bike problem. We are not allowed to cycle outside without a face mask and a face shield. So I thought of doing something to this face shield. I just came from a 100 kilometer ride to test out this Jason Machete inspired project. So guys, katuan lang ito ha. So the long and short of it, I will not use this face shield for cycling ever again. And I will tell you why. As a proof of concept, the perforations or yung mga butas na ginawa ko that I drilled in worked in terms of achieving good ventilation. So yung mga discomfort because mainit sa loob na face shield, ay hindi naging issue kailanman nung ride. And also, uh, hindi ago eksena sa view ko yung mga butas kasi ang pag-position ng mga perforations natin is just below the peripheral. No? So, kumbaga, yung area na nasasakupan ng typical cycling shades mo ay hindi natin nilagyan ng butas. Ang pinaka problema to begin with is yung face shield mismo. No? Maganda yung look or design niya actually and aerodynamic nga ang datingan niya. No? Kaya siya ang una kong choice for this experiment. Kaso, tingin ko, okay lang siya pag uh, naglalakad ka sa mall, sa office, etc. Hindi talaga siya pang cycling and of course, hindi ko naman sinasabi na design din siya for cycling. In-experiment lang natin to to see kung pwede. So, ano yung mga issues na na-encounter ko with the face shield during the ride? Ang pinaka-major issue na sa simula pa lang ng ride, obvious na talaga siya, is yung poor clarity ng view ng top portion. No? Itong area na ito, just above the nose line. Pero itong portion na ito, no? bandang eye level, pagka naka-upright body position ka, okay, malino siya. Pero kasi sa mga bikes ko, ang um, position ko mostly, medyo naka-lean forward. So, ang tendency ko is medyo nakayuko ang ulo, tapos yung mata, medyo nakatingin ng konti pataas. So, ang line of sight ko goes through this portion. No? And hindi siya malinaw. Parang may grado siya na wavy in some portions. In short, delikado. So, isipin mo yung shades mo. Yung upper portion, malabo. Yung middle to lower portion, ang malinaw. So, to compensate, tinutulak ko yung face shield. No? Para mag-press ng konti. And then, hahabulin ko ng konting upright position para dun ako sa bandang gitna ng face shield. No? Uh, titingin. Kaso, ang problema, dahil sa pawis and vibration, dumudulas yung face shield. So, mayat maya, ayos ako ng ayos ang face shield. The whole ride, I would say, is foggy. No? So, ang second major issue is yung hydration. Mahirap uminom ng tubig while riding kapag ka naka-face shield ka. Kailangan mo mag-stop, tanggalin mo na yung face shield, then tanggalin mo yung face mask, bago ka makainom. And for my last concern, is wala yatang UV protection ito. Siguro, hindi lang ako sanay na magsusuot ng mga ganito, pero ang experience ko kanina is parang ang liwanag ng sunshine pagka-suot siya. So, 
mainit sa balat and na-imagine ko tuloy na para akong may suot na magnifying glass sa ilalim ng araw. So again, as a proof of concept, the holes work to provide good ventilation and it did not obscure my view. So siguro hahanap na lang ako ng alternative face shield to try and experiment more. No? Pero in terms of antivirus or protection against COVID, obviously walang protection mabibigay sa'yo ang butas-butas na face shield. Kaya I suggest keep your mask on throughout the ride and avoid face-to-face -face conversations during your ride or during your stops. So again, in my honest personal opinion and based on my personal experience, I will not use this face shield for cycling. But we do have rules to follow, so kailangan natin makisama and we need to wear face shields while we ride. So we have to find a way to cooperate, avoid confrontations and arguments, so for our peace of mind. So perhaps may alam kayong potential na face shield na pwede for cycling or better yet, baka may alam kayong face shield na brand na ginawa talaga with cycling in mind. So please comment below, let me know. So if you like our little experiment, please consider subscribing para update pa kayo ng mga susunod kong rides and experiments. So it's me, June, the Barong Biker. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!